What is happening, everybody? This is the Big Jew, and welcome back to Dragon Quest VIII. No alchemy, Ron. Hey, yeah. All right, it's time to explore the Dragon Graveyard in its entirety this time. Yeah. If uh, you leave and come back, Cash yells at you, or whoever is, whoever you are a uh, partner, whoever you are defending or protecting will yell at you. All right, so yeah, let's go ahead and. Uh, Explore this joint. Yeah, enemies in here are pretty difficult, but you can run into king metal slimes and stuff like that. There's another new enemy here, a dragger. They can do some pretty nasty uh, flame breath on your players. Fortunately, they are vulnerable to flat, which is nice. Let's go ahead and get insulate on uh, everybody there. Or insulate. I'm just gonna call it insulate. I'm not gonna call it insulatal. No, I don't know why they like decided to add the L. They, they totally could have just hit insulate. It would have been perfect. But no, they had to go all... I don't know. I don't even know like what the term is to like butcher a certain word or I don't know, that, to add meaningless, superfluous, sur superf... Whatever the hell that term is. You know what I'm talking about. Of course, we're going to use insulate after getting hit with a flame breath. Absolutely, that's that's the way right there. Yep, superfluous words or stems to words that don't need it. Like adding old to insulate old. It's like really, like, is it really necessary? No, it's not necessary. Go ahead and now uh, heal Jessica there. Yes, as you can see, the flame breath that uh, the dragons produce is pretty nasty. So, yeah. And their attacks are just as bad. And Whack didn't kill the other dragon. That sucks. They have a lot of hit points. Jeez. Nice. Good to take them down. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go all out now. May as well. Multi-thrust, uh, yeah, parallax, may as well do parallax, yeah. Uh, multi-shot, and, um, let me go ahead and do Caduceus on, a uh, Governor there. Okay. Nicely done. Free heal more, or free mid-heal spell, or heal more, whatever the hell you want to call it. I'm going to call it heal more, I may as well. I don't know why they really, I mean, I understand that there was a different translation team, you know, level 5 instead of Square Enix themselves, or Armor Project rather, but still, man, like, why do they really have, why do they have to butcher all these names? I mean, is it to make a child friendly or something? I don't know, you know. Yeah, I get a lot of XP from these guys, which is nice. Okay. Now, let's see what we got in here. Okay, let's have to go. We go this way first, yeah. It'll lead us to some treasure. Yeah, alright. Let's go ahead and uh, heal before we do anything. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Let me heal Angela first. Yeah, you want your hit points to be above 150 just because, just in case you get ambushed by a whole bunch of dragons or Tyrannosaurus, you won't get killed by uh, Flame Breath there. Because if, you know, two or more of those enemies do flame breath, then you color yourself gone. Ooh, a Metal King slime. Nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and do Thunder Thrust. Get that all or nothing crit. Same with Executioner. Angel, we're going to do a multi-shot. Uh, I guess Jessica can blow kisses at it. Or it can just run. That too. If you kill a Metal King slime, you get 30,000 XP, which is, you know, fantastic in any part of the game there. Getting mid we get a mini medal, nice. Since the last episode I handed in my mini medals to Princess Mini and got Gold Nugget. Which isn't really useful, but the prize after the gold nugget, the meteorite bracer, is immensely useful. So yeah. And you get that with sixty mini mini medals, so there we go. Metal King Slime and a dragger. Should I go for it? May as well. May as well. Let's go ahead and do that, that. Uh, let me go ahead and try and do whack on, uh, the dragon and insulate on everyone else. Ooh, 
Whoa, whoa, that did a ton of damage. Jeez. Come on. Alright, good. We got to insulate off before uh, the dragon can do anything dumb. Like, breathe fire on us. Or just attack us. That'll work. Alright. Take him down. Nicely done. Yes. Well, that's 30,000 XP. We didn't do any crit to the uh, dragon. Well, big deal. Yeah. Doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and. Uh, no, no, no. Kadu oh, Kadusha's abilities. Let's go ahead and do that with Jessica. This way, off the heal after battle. I'm gonna pretty much run from everyone else now. Me as well. I might do two videos today. Just so I can get through this part legitimately and not have to get all the treasure, warp back out, and then and then retrace my steps because that would just be annoying. So I'm probably just gonna do two videos. Two video special, baby. Yeah. That parallax is really good. 1.5 your normal damage. 1.5 times the normal damage rather. 30,000 XP! Love it, baby. Alright. Governor learns Kassizzle. Nice. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use do Courage, just because I'm good with Spears for now. Oh, dang it. Or, Governor didn't learn any abilities with his uh, new Courage gains. Oh well, mm -hmm. it's fine. And Yangus, Axes and Humanity, you don't really care. Angela, okay, let's see what we can do with Angela here. I'm actually going to do uh, bows, since we do need some attack power boosts, and uh, and towards the end of uh, learning bows, you learn Shining Shot, which is really good. Nice. Yeah, at least his crit rate goes up, even though I'm never really going to do regular physical attacks with... Uh, Angelo, but whatever. Uh, let's see, staves or sex? Now let's bump up sex appeal to 20. And rightly so, since she's in that fantastic bikini there. Whoa! Well, yeah, also, yeah, really, huh. I mean, who, who wouldn't want to be checking out, you know, girl in bikini fighting him, you know what I mean? Like, would you really be hostile towards that? No. No, I wouldn't be. I'm trying to hit it, you know what I'm talking about. But anyways, Jessica, now her masculine hit magic points with a staff is at a hundred. It's up, it's up by a hundred. That's ridiculous. So, yeah. That's insane. Okay. Fortunately, the uh, Dragon Graveyard is not that complicated to go through, so, yeah. Very direct paths. And not that many, uh, what do you call it? Not that many treasure, not not much treasure to get, so. There's no enemy smackers, they, they're super powered versions of uh, Lipsies or whatever the hell they're called. So don't even worry about them. Well, uh, let's see, I want to go this way first, yeah. Get some more treasure, yeah. Although it's really pointless to get it, but whatever. You can get a shield in here that's awesome, that's amazing. I really care about that right now. Oh boy. Good, he attacked instead of did instead of doing flame breath. Thank god. Yeah, the smack I guess can also do magic barrier. Yeah. Doesn't protect doesn't protect them from being uh whacked, which you can use on them. Flat can pretty much kill them all in one shot. But I don't really care about them, to be quite honest. I think I've got enough XP in here. We get dragon dung. Yeah, great. Reach in the bag and get a, and get and get dragon dung. Yeah, that's the way. Nice. Thanks. Thanks, game. No, dragon dung can be used to make some pretty good items. So, I think you can make like super spicy cheese with it, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah. it's not bad. It's pretty good. Yeah. All right, and we have to go. That will just lead to a dead end over to the uh, left there. So let's go ahead and head towards the right. Yeah. There's one more treasure, but it's not until later on in the dungeon, so I'm not going to worry about it right now. 
More smackers. More running from more smackers. Yes. What? I don't need to fight them. I really don't. I think... No, I wasn't that. I'm thinking if that dead end was the uh, treasure, but no, I don't think it is. Let me go ahead and uh, heal. I keep forgetting to do that. And make sure you bring lots of magic potions for uh, Angelo, since he's going to be using magic in here quite a bit, just to heal and stuff like that. Okay, now what I think I need to do is... Not head over there, no. I got new enemies here. Bells of uh, Beals of Buzzes. They can cast Kerplunk and revive all of the other enemies at the expense of their own life. And that's pretty much all they do. They just kind of fly around to sit, sit there getting hit. And you can just beat on them until they all die. I'm not even going to worry about demonstrating them because why? So it's going to be it's going to be me kicking their asses. Hey, you're from the uh, party from the uh, from the Dark Island, Dark Ruins. Yeah, that's yeah, that's a uh, that's that original party that tried to go up against Dulmagus but chickened out. Yeah, that's them. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's pretty neat how you uh, encounter them here. You can encounter the knight and the uh, priest also. Yeah. But I don't really care about that at all. I really don't. <laughs> More Metal King slimes, but I'm going to run from them this time. If I can. Which I won't. That sucks. Yeah, go ahead and attack us. Do what you will. I don't really care. I really don't. But I killed one. I already killed one of them. I don't need to kill any more. And of course, as I'm running from them, then then they decide to attack us. Yeah, that's great. Although they don't run away nearly as uh, quickly as a metal, uh, liquid metal slimes, which is nice. But then again, of course, three liquid metal slimes equals one metal king slime. So. Yeah. And there's a there's an island we're gonna be encountering later on that pretty much guarantees a metal slime encounter with uh, every encounter. Every encounter will be with liquid metal slimes and such. Yeah. There we go. And here we get the dragon shield. Yeah. But that island is uh, going to come into play much later. Not right now though. Dragon shield does what you think it does. It protects you from breath attacks. Good stuff. I'm gonna give it to Governor. This way, his uh, protection is more diverse. This way, he can defend himself from spells and breath, which is nice. So there we go. Very good. And I will continue this. Uh, I will continue going through here and getting to the seal of Golding next time on Dragon Quest VIII: No Alchemy Run. This is the Big Jew telling you to keep being awesome. And stay tuned for uh, the very next video. Peace.